Hey, everybody from Wanship, Utah, and the beautiful High West Distillery, where we are relaxing and we are talking about delicious whiskey. Isaac Winter from High West Distillery is joining me now. Isaac, man, thank you so much for having us out because this place is absolutely gorgeous. You have to love working here. Absolutely. Welcome to our distillery. We're up here on top of a mountain overlooking Wanship, Utah. This is our main production facility behind me here. We produce about 130,000 proof gallons of whiskey or about 2,200 barrels full. And we'll do about 210,000 cases of whiskey all from this location. That's really impressive. And I know the distillery actually has history that's like going all the way back into the 1800s. Absolutely. So we, um, we opened our doors in 2009 and we are the first legal distillery since Prohibition. What, what do you love so much about this location? What do you love uh, so much about uh, this distillery? I love the commitment to the craft. I know that um, you know that's that's maybe an easy thing, but everyone from admin to ops to hospitality is um, totally backing this brand and and wants to make sure that we are super consistent, super high quality, and and doing Utah you know a, a bit of justice. So folks can not only come down here, uh, they can visit this distillery, but you also have two locations in Park City that people can go and stop in. Absolutely. So we have one consumer facing location here, great. Sunday brunch, um, but we also have a location uh, downtown Park City on Park Street, the saloon. We also distill from that location, and then two doors up the uh, two doors up the street, we've got the Nelson Cottage, which is a you know a, a, a private events focus space. We also do a prefix menu. It's where our chefs go to play. We've got a whiskey sommelier. It's a great high touch, cool guest experience. That that sounds like a fun afternoon or evening. I'm not going to lie. Uh, I, here's the thing. Uh, you guys are taking kind of an old favorite and you're putting a new face on it, so to speak, and uh, all of it is going to really raise awareness about a great cause. Absolutely. So we've got High West Campfire Whiskey that's coming out as a limited in Utah, and we've uh, committed to, to releasing this whiskey full time uh, through our hospitality locations at the, um, at the distilleries. We've partnered with Ed Mel to reimagine what the label would be like. Um, he's a prominent Western artist and, and we really enjoyed kind of coming up with a new design and giving Campfire a little bit of a facelift. Still the same whiskey, same blend, bourbon, rye, and a little bit of Scotch whiskey. We just wanted to, to draw attention to, you know, the issues surrounding, uh, you know, fi wildland fire fires in Utah and just really promote people to, to keep the campfire in a glass this year and check out Wildland Firefighter Foundation. Well, this sounds awesome and it's a great cause and we want to encourage people uh, to get more information on that. But hey, if people want more information on High West Distillery, where should they go? Uh, I would check out uh, Drink High West on uh, Instagram, highwest.com for our website. You can make um, you know, reservations for brunch. We don't take reservations at the, uh, at the saloon location, but we encourage you to come see us. So it's first come, first serve at the saloon first in Park City. First come, first serve. Well, this is uh, such a great spot, you guys, and if you're ever looking for a great place to kind of get away for just an afternoon or an evening, this is the place. So uh, thank you so much, Isaac. Thank you for having me.